guys, here's what's what in gaming this week. Your top five biggest news countdown starts now. Number five, Bungie held a live stream that gave us a bunch of new details on Destiny's upcoming House of Wolves expansion. The single best piece of info to come out of it? Well, Guardians will be able to upgrade existing legendary and exotic gear this time around. Better yet, players who don't buy the DLC will also have access to upgrades into the social area in the Reef, the Vestrian Outpost. Y-E-S. Number four, Mortal Kombat X is out and spreading fatalities throughout the land, but an extra story pack may be on its way if a recent Twitter tease from MKX creator Ed Boon is to be believed. In a Twitter response to a fan question, Boon hints at a story pack and well, that was the extent of it. I guess people really want one as it made top five despite the details for this one being very scarce, they're practically non-existent. Another MK News, Patch 1.02 is out and adds the classic Sub-Zero skin for free. According to NetherRealm, all future DLC patches of this kind will come with a free skin, so that's pretty cool. Number 3, Activision dropped a new Call of Duty Black Ops 3 teaser trailer. Featuring live action, the trailer takes a look at human augmentation and what happens when we can't control our future advancements in robotics and technology. It counts up to the year 2060, the year the story will most likely take place. More details on IGN. Number two, Microsoft released a kick-ass new trailer for Halo 5 Guardians showing off our friendly neighborhood UNSC elite manhunter Spartan Locke taking out Covenant while on the hunt for Master Chief. New armor, weapons, and abilities are all showcased in this action-packed non-gameplay trailer. And number one, Star Wars Battlefront will feature eight maps and a ton of content, according to the game's producer, Jesper Nielsen. Taking to Reddit to state, if you think there's anything we're not including in the game to save it for DLC, I can tell you, you're 100% wrong. Good to know nothing will be held back. My expectation level is now set to high. And that's your top five gaming news of the week. Be sure to check out the rest of this week's Daily Fix episodes for more news, and see you next week, guys. Bye.